All right, back to the mason bees here. I think it's about time I put them on. The daffodils are uh, just about to come up. And I made this release box right here, just a little box with a hole in it. Make sure the hole's big enough for the uh, bees to come out. And here are the cocoons. Now that one bee I had in there, he's right in here. He's still alive. So I'm moving his legs around in there. I'll take him out there. In. There we go. There's a little guy right there. So anyways, I'm going to put him and every other one in this box here. Daddy, sting yeah, he's going to sting me. Eh? There we go. Get him in there. These guys in there. I didn't even bother cleaning these things. But as you can see, they're still living. At least that one bee is. I'll stick them all in there. I'll take that closed and I'll stick them right up under here next to their house, the empty house that they're going to move into. Thanks for watching. Well, there's the bee. It's been a few minutes and uh, there he is right there. Come out the hole. Stretching out his legs, warming up. The poor guy has been in the fridge for about three weeks because we had a cold snap here. But today's a nice day for him. Stretch those little leggies. Alright, thanks for watching. Just coming out like crazy. About 20 minutes and they chew through their cocoons and out they come. Look at that. That's neat.